testing, testing, one, two, three. Hey, hello, hi, and welcome to my channel. This is my first ever YouTube video that I am making, and it's going to be based around Mermaid Swamp. Um, let me just pull it up here. Yes, Mermaid Swamp. Uh, I'm not sure if you guys want me to do um, voice acting or leave the voice acting up to the game. So until then, I think I'm just going to leave it up to the game and you guys can come down below what you guys really want more if you want my voice acting, which is not that good, or the game's voice acting. Yeah, let's uh, get started. Okay, so overall it looks like hmm, it just gives off warnings and advice to like not cut off the credits and all that. Hmm. Okay. Play the full voice acting to a partial voice acting. The full VA or dialogue is voice the partial VA only sound effects sound effect voice clips play. You can change the setting from the in game menu. Okay. I'm gonna choose full VA. What the? Am I underwater? What the hell am I doing? Hold on. Somebody there? Friend? Red, wake up! For crying out loud, just get up already. Ah, shut up! I was just taking a nap, that's so bad. One hell of a nap. You just been driving all this time and you've just been snoozing in the back. Sheesh, not a hit of lady in this one. Ain't gotta be a lay like for a punk like you. Ren, rise and shine. Since you started around noon, I'm guessing you slept well? Well, it was a rude awakening with the with gray hairs here. But sure, I slept well. But you're yammering, Yamazaki. By the way, you know. Barbie. Anyway, you said something about getting into high gear, but are we in the mountain or what? Mountains or what? Haha, <laughs> my bad. I don't know where this is either. Huh? You're telling me we're lost. Yep. Don't have the first clue where we are. You're kidding. You said the mountains for a shortcut, so I thought you knew the way. Sorry about that. I mean, I did kind of know at first, but the fog got so thick so sooner or later. Haha. <laughs> that ain't- that ain't funny, shrimp face. That- that- uh, This is exactly why I don't want to go on no field trip on your rusty old no GPS car. Oh, don't be like that. I said sorry. Well, now what do we do? I don't even see any signs around. Huh? Why did you stop? I don't know. We just stopped moving. Hold on a sec. I'll check the- I'll test the engine. Oh crap, that's so good. Sounds like it's all- it's totally busted. Are you for real? Oh, 
dumbass. Ugh. Wait here, I'll go out and take a look at, at the car. The next two episodes here. Why the hell it stopped? Guess just to get it won't do much. Go this way. Hey, somebody there? Wait, hold on, let me see if my... Okay. Everything seems okay, but for some reason I can't hear anything. Why, surprise! What would you be doing in the up in these mountains, miss? Freak me the hell out, right? I was on the trip with my college pals, but our car went kaput, kaput. so we're kind of stuck. Oh, that's very unfortunate. Do you have anywhere you can stay? Nope, nothing. If we can't get it running, I guess we'll be spending the night in the car. Oh, that would be most terrible. My home is nearby. By all means, stay there. Even in summer, it's quite cool at night. Huh? For real? Well, let me just talk to my buds. What a relief. Thank you, old man. But you're sure now? We don't want to put any pressure on you. Now, now, I own the land in these parts, you see? My house is size far outstrips my own needs. Ah, that's right. I should introduce myself. My name is Yukio Tsuchida. I'm just a lonely young man living on my own. Some, so some young folks would liven up. Bleh. So some young folks would liven up. Uh, bleh, 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 bleh. So some young folks would liven up the house. I'm really grateful. We'll just be. Good. I'm really grateful. We'll just get the car fixed and leave tomorrow. This here is my house. Whoa! This place is huge! That's a pretty huge pond. Artificially made, I bet. Oh no, that's swamp. The house was built by the nearby swamp. I see a mansion over there too. It's is that also your house, Mr. Sh Sh Shida? Indeed, but it's not being used now. I had this new one built around the late 80s. Now it's getting chilly, so let's be getting inside. I'll show you to the guest rooms. You may use this room, Miss Ren. Ah, do forgive the mustiness. It ain't nothing. I kinda like the retro style this got's going. Thanks again, Gramps. Say, I'm sure you're all hungry, aren't you? I'll cook you some dinner. Until then, please make yourself at home. Hey, Rin, 
You better not be rude to Mr. Shichita. We're in debt to him for the day. Eh? What do you mean rude? I mean, don't go calling him an old coot. And don't make the man so much for dinner. Well, maybe that's not that impudent. Y yeah. Have you seen penis in the hall? No, haven't yet. You should. You should look later. There's some really pretty pictures of ladies. Oh, gotcha. I'll take the other. Is there options? I don't hear anything. Why can't you hear anything? Oh, it's part of it. Is that okay? Nope, that's not why. I guess this game is gonna have no sound. Hey, listen, Ren. Isn't this one outside the house the hugest? I might have to look earlier. It's real pretty. Oh, really? I was thinking it was kind of goopy and filthy. Now, oh man, look later, okay? I might ask if we can go swimming tomorrow. Well, don't you come near me after that. You're gonna reek. Does it burn? Mm. Oh, that is not pretty. That's, that's, that's not pretty. The hell is this? Creepy. Oh, we're back here. Alright, so that's... That's pretty. Oh, you're already, already in there. What is it? Small sink. It's not. The bathtub? The bathtub is pretty large. Body soap and shampoo. A bath soap. Body soap. Shampoo. 
that's oh these are gorgeous That's beautiful. Oh, Miss Friend, I was thinking of making chicken and egg all rice. Would that be all right? Or I prefer beef and veggies, actually. Unfortunately, I'm all out of beef. I'm terribly sorry. Well, I'm starving. So, I'll eat anything. Add some extra leaks to mine, alright? Ha! <laughs> Understood. It'll be ready very soon, so just take it easy. Okay, what's this one? Ah. Uh, go up here? Probably should have go upstairs without asking. Okay, so I can... Well, that's one big swamp. I can't even see to the other side through this fog. Hmm? What's this? A stone monument? Uh, a man did abduct upon the seashore. Crap, I can't read this. Maybe it's like tarot. Sataros know about his own stuff. He's got more knowledge than he knows what to do with. Oh, hello. Curious about the monument? Oh, the old man. You really got to not do that. Oh, my apologies. So, have you read the description there? Nah, couldn't make heads or tails, but what to say? It's a legend that's told around here. The legend of the so-called mermaid swamp. Legend? Mermaid swamp. It originated in the middle of the Meiji era. My family has governed this area since around that time. Or rather, we simply owned the mountains. It is said that the son of a leader descended the mountains reached the seaside, and found a mermaid. Sounds kind of shady right out of the gate. Haha. <laughs> well, it is illegal. I mean... <laughs> what is illegal? Nah. <laughs> well, it is a legend. The man was so smitten in the mermaid's beauty he took that he took her to the, his mountain home. He created a fish tank just for her and had her live within. And he filled it with water from the ver from this very swamp. But the mermaid of the sea cares not for sw swamp water. The mermaid grew weak and became quite ugly. Her clear skin swelled, her scales fell off, and her voice was melodic as r ringing bells and reduced to a beastly howl. The mermaid soon took on the most repulsive form and sub subsequently died. As the mermaid's wrath is surely been no pretty thing, young woman vanished from the nearby village. No people And a mermaid's breath is surely no pretty thing. When young women, young women vanish from the nearby village, people call that the mermaid's curse. As such, the monument was put up to mourn her. What do you think? Hard to call it romantic, but interesting nonetheless, yes? Uh, uh, sorry, but I don't know about all that. So I with like stories and stuff, so he might get in more.
Oh, ho, is that right? Ah, yes. I prepared dinner now. So come to the dining room if you could. Oh, finally. Okay. Just get move on. Mmm, delish. This is some great stuff, old man. The old man has a name. I'm glad you like it. Take it slow and eat up. Ah, and the bath is free if anyone wants to use it. You must be tired from the day's events. Please, press yourselves. See you. You got it. You weren't going to eat? What's up? Yeah, I guess I'm just too tired to have an appetite. Well, you okay? We'll do the cleanup. You can go get some rest. Alright, thanks, Yuta. Yummy, yummy. Okay, y'all clean up now. Why do we have to clean up after you? Do it yourself, yama yucky. Man, I'm stuffed. Can't be bothered to bathe. I'm ready to conk out. Am I underwater a bit? Must be a dream. I'm not drowning and my eyes don't hurt. Can't move a muscle though, and it's really cold. Somebody's there again. Who the hell is it? Why are you staring at me? I'll kill ya. Is it morning? Man, that was a strange dream. Uh, you okay, that's pretty. Yo, Yuka, it's morning, you know. You ready to get up? Sorry, Ren. I've kind of got the chills. It's okay if I rest a little longer. I got you. Are you okay, though? Don't overdo it. Yeah, I'm fine. It's really foggy out, so maybe I've got a cold. Early. What are you up to? As if it's actually early, it's already 10. But anyway, I checked on the car earlier and it's still totally busted. Can it be out of gas? It's so old, I wouldn't blow it out if it's just falling apart. But whatever it is, how are we gonna leave? Good morning, everyone. What's happening here? So that's the story, old man. I'm really sorry, but we, but can we stay a little longer? A while long. <laughs> so that's the story, old man. I'm real sorry, but can we stay a while longer? I want to see if I can fix. I can't fix my car. See if I we can't fix the car. I don't mind at all, but as it happens, I have to go out for a few days to the nearby village on some business. I must be leaving around evening. Is that right? Well, we'll be out soon then. We wouldn't want to stay long. Even without a car, we should find our way walking. We could leave the car and take a train home if need be. At any rate, just gotta go down the mountain. 
No, that's quite a right for you to say. I'm the only one who lives here, after all. And I would probably appreciate someone looking after it. Huh? Really? Indeed. Besides, you wouldn't get far walking in the mountains. Certainly not in this fog. You're more than welcome to stay until your car is fixed. Just please don't do anything dangerous like walking around the mountains. Alright, thanks Gramps. Well then, I've got to be heading out. Keep a close eye on the, um, any flames. And again, the mountains are dangerous, so don't. We get it, okay? We'll hold on the floor. Don't worry, old man. Don't go trip and die yourself. You hear? Haha. <laughs> I'll be careful. So long. Okay, it's evening already. Better be the first to use the bath. I'd hate to go on it after the guys. Stuff. I was so busy yesterday, I couldn't even get a relaxing bath in. And having a huge one like this to the sleep. I wonder if Yuka's gonna bathe. Sucks that she's not feeling well. Waste of the trip. I'm getting sleepy. The, the water? Got all gross. It wasn't this color when I got in, right? Not my fault, right? I'm not that dirty, right? Oh, you, oh, oh. How dare you, Saitaro, Saitaro, barging in the girl naked. Hey, what's the matter? The hell are you barging it on me for? Bro, though, this is like mud. Just how gross is that body of yours? Shut your mouth! That ain't the problem! The water just got all muddy, just like that. Alright, jokes aside. Just aside then. Isn't this swamp water? Swamp water? Why would that be in the bath, genius? I don't know. Maybe the plumbing screwed up. So it mixed in some swamp water. So the shower and toilet look okay. Well, they're in the bath for a while, I guess. If I have to hold out till the old man's back. Okay, I'm out. Damn it! What even? Ugh! This pisses me off. I'll check on you, then go to get to bed. That is this one, right? Yes. She's sound asleep, but she's shivering. Must be feeling really sick. I gotta make her hurry to me tomorrow. Maybe take some cold medicine. Well, I just remember my phone's dead. Better get a charging. Is there an open road here?
a desk. The desk is passing a lid on it. Oh, I can touch the phone here. And then... Okay. All right. Now do our bedtime. I hear water again. Fresh hell? The house is filled of water. It's full of water. Right? Just a dream. I was more drowning. Boy, what a weird dream. Hmm? Was there something there? It went towards Yuka's room. Oh my god. I know you're in the water and all, but can you move any slower? Huh? Ugh. Just dream. What an awful dream. Okay guys, we're gonna end it here. Thank you all so much for joining me on this Mermaid Small Book Adventure. I'll see you all in the next video. Like comment down if you want me to continue to do the voice acting or if you want the game's voice acting with show, can you please Comment down below how to fix the volume so I can hear it because I have no idea what I'm doing because I'm still pretty new to this gaming streaming. Yes. That. Anyway, I'll see you all next time. Bye bye!